How you doing, my people? Good Sunday noon. I am Real Talk. Today I want to talk about the tongue and the words that flows off the tongue. Idle body is of the devil's workshop. That that um, have nothing better to do but to sit around and gossip. The idle body is the devil's workshop. In the devil's workshop, that is where they build all sorts of stuff. But everything that they built, or you built out there, is not for good. You're building a bridge to collapse, to divide people. Idle body is the devil's workshop. And when we're building stuff, if we're not doing it pure from our heart, and doing it for the love of God, then we're doing everything wrong. You know, I will not give a name, but you can figure it out who was watching this video. Years ago, someone was wishing for um, her sister to fall, or marriage to dissolve. All these things that she was wishing on her sister. For years. Wishing bad. From the tongue, the, the words roll off. Wishing bad. That everything that was bad could happen to her sister. But my people, be careful. What you wish for, you just might get. And this person did. Their marriage was dissolved instead. From her mouth came her own destruction. My people, be careful what you wish for. Be careful who you talk about. Because God have his way of turning things around. Idle body is the devil's workshop. Because we have nothing but time on our, on our hand, and instead of we use these times to do good, we go from house to house, to your brothers, to your brothers, to your brothers, and spread gossip, spread rumors, do all sorts of wicked stuff, and don't understand that what you're doing, today you're doing it and you're getting away with it. But tomorrow, it will come at your door. God have a way of working things out. The words from our mouth that rolls off our tongue is very, very powerful. If that words that you cannot see, but you can hear, rolls off your tongue and it's getting to the wrong person's ears, that person that it is getting into their ears will want to do harm to someone for what they heard. Not from what they see, not from the truth, but for what they heard. Because then now they're prejudging and cast wicked thoughts over you. The words from your mouth is a dangerous thing, my people. Get out of that devil's workshop. 
because his workshop it is no good for your soul. If you stay there long enough, he's going to keep you there. Eternity. And you cannot escape that once you're there. You cannot come above to want to enter now into the kingdom of heaven because you already made your decision. You already made your choice. Your choice was made when you accept Lucifer as your savior. Instead of the Lord Jesus Christ that is full of love and compassion. My people, if you're hearing this message today, I say to you, get out of the devil's workshop before it's too late. If you think about gossiping about someone, cut your tongue off because it do you no good because all it's doing is bringing you down. The words from your mouth will be your destruction, my people. If we do not have something good to say about someone, say nothing at all. And that applies to me as well. Because I am not far from what I do that is wrong. I am also accountable for my, for my actions and for my sins. So when I speak to you, you trust and believe, I'm also speaking to myself. When I come to you, I'm not coming to you as a savior. But, I, but I, I, I'm trying to get there. I'm coming to you as a sinner, but I'm bringing the light to you, I hope. Let us stop um, this gossiping, this going to the devil's workshop and building all stuff that's destruction for our souls. We have a chance of saving ourselves before it's too late, as long as we're living here on earth. Like I said in my other videos, because once we, we pass on, all our chance stop to be saved and judgment begin. Let us work as one on this earth, brothers and sisters, not based on color, not based on religion, not based on anything but love. Let us help each other. Let us uplift each other. You know, it's a great feeling when someone is in need and you can help them. And when they offer you something or say, I wish I had something to give you, and you like, no. Nah. The greatest feeling of all, at least to me, is if I see someone break down in the road or, or something, someone, someone wants something to eat, and I can help them, that is the greatest feeling in the world. Because it's compassion, my people. It's a compassion. It's not based on color, religion. It's based on love. Let's share the love. Cut out our tongue if we have to talk negative of someone. If someone comes to you to talk about someone that is negative, walk away from them. Because they're bringing nothing but the devils to you. They're from the devil's workshop. They're not from God's workshop. An idol body it is not good for your soul because it is inside the devil's workshop and as long as the devil can use you any way he can get at you he will do so because he don't love you he wants you in hell with him so you can be tormented and tormented and tormented for eternity begging for water because you're so thirsty Begging, begging for, the, for the pain to stop because it hurts so much. A million times over the pain hurts. But you cannot get out of the hell because you're there for eternity. But if you listen to this video, you can escape the hell if, if we just choose Jesus Christ as our Lord and Savior and walk with Him. Yes, we are sinners and we all will sin. But that don't mean he won't forgive us if we ask for it. Sincerely meaning from our heart, he will forgive us. My people, this video is going to be short. Thank you for listening. Pass the word. It's about love and compassion. Let no one fool you. If someone say to you, man, bump this love stuff. That's for sissies. That's for punk. 
They don't know the, the, the power of God. And they will never know the power of God because God is love. All right? Pass the love, man. Um, have a good Sunday. Follow me on my Anchor channel, also on Spotify, on and my, pod, pop, my uh, podcast, The Path of Peace TV. Also on Facebook, The Path of Peace TV. Please like, share, and subscribe. And may God bless you.